Okay, this is just a quick test video um, to test the equipment and to test the software. And apparently there's kind of a little bit of a bug in the system. And I'm trying to make sure it all works. Um, so here we go. I'm just going to do this very quickly and see if it loads up. That's all. And then I'll delete the video. Good morning, everybody. I hope uh, everybody understood the last video. I'm really glad to see that those believers out there that do understand how important it is that you understand uh, if you're going to be in Jesus' church, you got to be on the rock, the Petra. If you don't even know what the rock is, uh, you better seek it out with all your heart. I've shown it to you. Once you figure things out, you'll know that we have been bred with another race of beings, and then the Bible will validate all that for you, but you've got to look into the Bible. In fact, you got to go look up some meanings of some words and, and get a, you know, there's a real good program, uh, it's eSword, let's use this. I'll show you, let me, let me show you a good Bible tool to use um, while I'm doing this test. This is eSword now, it's just real simple for beginners and stuff, there's other programs that are more extensive and you know um but and they're very costly too some of them but let me show you the way this works you go you pick a chapter like genesis or let's say matthew so, well first of all let's um let me show you something real quick this is i'm using what's called the kjv plus and that means it's king james version plus you see these circle these numbers that is the concordance, the strongest concordance. And what it does is it translates every single word for you. So, you know, you want to see what the word woman is right there in Genesis uh, 3. And you can click on that number and it will bring it down here. And it says H Hebrew number 802 Ish Shah and Nashim. The first form of the feminine, age 36 and age 582. When the second form is an irregular plural woman used in the same one since as age 13, adulterous. So when you're looking at these words and you see these numbers, here's where the derivation of the word comes from. There are many words in Hebrew for the word woman, uh, just like in Spanish. I speak fluent Spanish. Um, there are a variety of words you can use that convey the thought woman. Um, however, to use a word that conveys the thought adulterous is a very specific word. So therefore you can ascertain what the implied meaning of that word is. And that way you can get a more accurate representation of what the scripture says. And when you add that to the spiritual gift, you know, uh, like uh, the Just Messenger series that I did back in 2008, and you see an alien having sex with a human female, well, then you're like, now everything makes sense. Okay, so anyway, I'm just, like I said, I'm just trying this out. I want to see if this thing works. I'm going to pause it now. I just, like I said, this is a test video. See if it uploads. Thank you.